Hey everybody, it's Masai with another video today, and today I am doing one for the follower alert custom image I made for Heroes of the Storm. Uh, I'm going to be sharing it with everyone in the Heroes community, whether you're a streamer or not, uh, for free, no charge. And the only thing I ask from this is just give credit where credit is due. That's it. If somebody asks you where you got it, just say that cool Masai guy that lives in the internets somewhere. Um, but yeah, let's go over what uh, the finished product and all that stuff is that I'm actually going to be giving away here. Uh, this is the template that's going to be going out with everybody. Heroes of Storm looks really, really good. It's not overboard. It's not, you know, people blowing up other people or anything like that. Very simple, but very, very clean, very nice. I think it looks amazing. So let's get into it. Um, let me show you how to set this up with night dev now if you're not familiar with what night dev is night dev is a follow alert system for all twitch streamers that you can use free of charge what it does is it shows you every new follower popping up on your screen now there's certain techniques you have to have it to set this up but i'm going to go over this for exploit users sorry obs i know but uh the good thing is that night dev actually puts a video in here and the download installer so you'll be good to go all right, so let's get started with this with the XSplit. We're going to do the whole kind of setting it up and all that good stuff. So hit next. As you can see here, I started semi-doing it. Uh, what you're going to use for your Twitch username needs to be spot on of what you're going to be using for your stream. It has to be 100% correct. Now for the alert style for this version that I'm giving out, it's going to be use my own text centered. The custom alert is going to be the template. You're going to choose the one that I gave you here. Or if you want, you can make your own template if you have PS, which is Photoshop. It's going to come up as a PSD file. Sound you can also choose. I have sound enabled on my stream, but on this one, you're not going to have any sound. So it's up to you if you want to use it and put your own in there. You can use sound files from movies, video games. You can even put fart sounds in if you really want to. If you're that kind of stream, go ahead. Every time, every time someone falls, someone farts you're good to go um, so that part is pretty simple there let's go into the next part here this is the main part this is the hosted URL this is what's going to be showing up as the green screen and the animation what we're going to do is we're going to copy this true value down here copy that and paste it into there and then we're going to copy all of that go up to your browser window enter it in and hit enter and as you can see, it pops up top there with test user of what the username is going to be, whoever does sign up for you. Now to go over real quick how to capture this in XSplit, we're going to go to Add and then Screen Capture. So let me show you how you're going to end up working on this. What you're going to do is go back to the browser page, hit Enter. It's going to drop down like that. You're going to go back to XSplit real fast, Screen Capture, click and drag, get where it's right like that. And boom, as you can see, it's on the screen there. And I'm actually going to hit this one more time just for anyone out there who's trying to see what it pops up. So there you go. And you can actually move it around and all that good stuff. So the question is, but Messiah, you probably have all that green on your stream. What, what are you doing, bro? Uh, actually, it's pretty simple. What's going to happen is you're going to go, you're going to click the one that you want to edit, hit settings. It's going to pull right up to the color screen and you're going to hit chroma key that way all the green is just it vanishes that's the cool thing about streaming nowadays if you just like if you have a green screen standing behind you you can crop out your whole background where it's just you the chair and a microphone or whatever you have that's right in front of you all right so let's put this over to the side here minimize these and let me show you what my finished my finished product looks like when I'm all done with mine. So again, we're gonna set mine up. As you can see that little sound, I'll show you what it is in one second. There we go, all right, test user right there. We're gonna hit settings, chroma key. All right, and we're gonna just kind of size it up of how we want to. All right, and here we go, and what I'm gonna do is hit enter and boom there you go as you can see you can float around the screen it makes a little sound that's a custom sound I added to my to my own uh, night devil alert and it's pretty awesome so that's it gonna be for the video um, I just want to say to everyone who uh, well my browser was acting up I just want to say uh, 
enjoy it. Uh, like I said, no charge for any of it. Just all I ask for is that you actually just say who made it for you and all that good stuff. Well, that's going to be it for the video today, folks. If you'd like, always check out my stream. If you're looking for a great stream to watch at twitch.tv slash messiah and uh, doing some shoutcast videos on there as well. Look out for more graphics that I'm going to be doing for these sort of uh, follower alerts, etc. in the future. Again, thanks everyone for checking out the video, and until next time, Messiah's out.